With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. In this question, we have three vertices of a parallelogram A, B, C and we have to find the vertex D by plotting them on a graph and also have to find the midpoint of the line segment CD. So first of all, let us draw the Cartesian system. So this is our coordinate system, right? And now we have to point the plot, plot the different different points. So point A is minus 2, comma 2. That means X is minus 2 and Y is 2. So this point is going to lie somewhere between this this point is going to lie somewhere between this minus 2 comma 2 is here right so this point is point a and let us write the coordinates also so this is minus 2 comma 2 now we have to write the point b 6 comma 2 so x equals to 6 and y equals to 2 so this is 6 comma 2 point b and let us write the coordinates also so this is 6 comma 2 after that C is having coordinates 4 comma minus 3 x equals to 4 y equals to minus 3 that is this point and this becomes point C with coordinates for 4 comma minus 3. Now we have to join these la these points to form a parallelogram basically so this is line segment AB now we have to po join these points BC so this is our line segment BC like this. After that, we have to find the coordinates of point D. So, we know that in a parallelogram, the opposite sides are equal in length. So, we can say that AB must be equals to CD. AB must be equals to CD. And to calculate the length of AB, we are going to use the distance formula, which says that if A is a point with coordinates x1, comma y1 and b is a point with coordinates x2 comma y2 then to calculate the distance between the two points as a b is given as under root of x1 minus x2 whole square plus y1 minus y2 whole square so this is the val this is the way in which we can calculate the distance between two given points with help of distance formula so when we are applying this formula we obtain the value of distance between ab as equals to minus 2 minus 6 that is under root of minus 8 square plus minus 2 plus 2 minus 2 that is 0 so that becomes under root of minus 8 square so that becomes 8 so AB is equals to 8 now in the similar manner we are going to calculate the distance between BC so this comes out to be so when we calculate BC this comes out to be under root of 4 minus 6 square that becomes under root of 2 square plus difference between 2 minus minus 3 that becomes under root of 5 square so this becomes under root of 29 so this distance is under root 29 now we know that the point D is going to be 8 units away from point C parallel to point parallel to the line segment AB so we can clearly mark the point D 8 units away in this direction so this is going to be like if we calculate 8 units so this is unit 1 unit 2 unit 3 unit 4 unit 5 unit 6 unit 7 unit 8 so D is going to be here so coordinates of D become x equals to minus 4 and y equals to minus 3 that is minus 4 comma minus 3 and now we have to join the point so when we join D with C so this is the line segment which we obtain and when we have to join A with D so this is the line segment which we obtain right now the distance between CD this D is going to basically be this is D is a straight line so this is going to be like this now it is a perfect line and now we have to find the midpoint of line segment CD so how can we do that we can do it graphically also and we can do it with help of a formula so if we use graphical method then we can clearly see that it is going to be 4 units away from point D so it is going to lie 4 units away that is this are the coordinates of midpoint of this let us say it as O and the coordinates become 0 comma minus 3 since it is lying on the negative y axis and to calculate it with help of a formula we can calculate the distance between 
between CD. So CD is going to be 8. So to, calc to calculate the location of a point which is basically 4 units away from point D is going to be this point. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.